look at you. My little girl, all grown up, back from saving the world. Look at you. You look great, Dad. You didn't get my letters, did you? You're like Bob. You know, I tried calling you, but um, it's almost impossible to try you to know, track you seriously. down. Nine months ago, you were older and wider and shorter. I have news. It's gonna be a no oh, all of a sudden kind of thing, and I didn't really want it to be a who all of a sudden kind of thing, but you're here, and so I kind of have to tell you, and so whew, here it goes. Um, I, I miss the boots. Are you a boot guy now? I'm just going to try to rip the band-aid off kind of thing, so... And is there product in your hair? Wait, do you have more hair? I met a man. He's here, now upstairs. You know, he's responsible for the boots, the hair, and the new body, and I love him. <laughs> a man. Here. A man here, now, who you love. And we're getting ready to watch RuPaul's Drag Race. Wait, what kind of middle-aged man watches RuPaul's Drag Race? A really cool young one. Young one? What do you mean? How young? Well, not, kind of not that young. Well, I mean, kind of young, but I mean, kind of your age. My age? What's his name? Cooper Taylor? Cooper Taylor. The same Cooper Taylor that went to Madison and was on the track team with me. Great. So you've met. Um, so now we could just skip the whole awkward phase and just go. <sighs> Look, I know this is really Google crazy, but I have never felt this way in my life. And Cooper's, he's smart and he's funny and we go out and we do interesting things. You don't do interesting things, okay? You're a dentist. You like teeth and 60 minutes. But Cooper showed me there's so much more to life than, than work and news shows. Oh my God, honey, the sex. Don't even get me started about the sex. You have my word there. Did you know he was a gymnast? The things he could do with his body, I couldn't even imagine doing when I was 12 years old. Using his toes, do you know he can lift? Dad, please. I just, I, oh, I don't, I don't even know how to begin. Like, does mom know about this? Please. Your mom is still in Santa Fe with her yoga instructor. Uh, guru, Ramadama, who the hell cares? I don't, I don't even want to think about that. How did this even happen? I mean, how did you meet? <gasps> he rear-ended me. <laughs> right there on Sherman Avenue, right in front of the Amco. Isn't that funny? It's it was perfect while we were both there waiting for our cars to get fixed. We sat in the lobby and drank free coffee and watched Kelly Clarkson and Wendy Williams. How you doing? <laughs> and then right before Ellen, I knew he was the one. Penelope, honey, I know this is a whole lot to take in. Just asking you to have an open mind. Please?